Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and in this video I will show you to use manual element in Elementor. So first of all we need to go in dashboard and let me show you the plugins that I have installed. So here you can see I have installed Elementor Pro, Element Skips Pro and after that Essential Add-ons. So next go to element skip header footer and after that here you can add any of the section like header footer and many more. So just click next so that it starts element kits and after that go to header footer builder. So next just click on add new. And here you can give name like my header. So next you can apply conditions. If you want to enable on entire website, you can select this option. And if you want to display on specific page, you can select singular. And if you want to display on archive pages like category pages, you can select here. After that, simply click on activate if you want to activate it immediately. So after that, click on edit with Elementor. So that's great. Next click on plus icon and after that here you can select column interface that you require. So at this time I want to use, so let me check, I want to use this one and just click on logo. So add a logo image, here you can upload and here I want to use this one after that you can adjust it or resize it alright so next you can align it and here we can use menu so here you can see these are various menu elements so this comes with essential add-ons and also if we scroll down so this is from elementor and this is element skips nav menu so let me show you the difference at this time i want to use essential add-ons advanced menu so next just click on menu so here you can see this is after that you can select layout by default it has seven layouts so you can select one by one and check which which one is best for you so this looks very cool and after that you can check for other skills or layouts so this is also looking great and after that you can check others So here you can change the layout so you can see this looks great and after that I think the this one skin one is best so you can see it looks cool so here you can add a gap from top so go to advanced tab and add a margin like 20 or 10 pixel so you can align accordingly after that i have only two items in menu so you can add more and more items so just go to appearance menu tab And here you can add more items so just click on any item like this and click on add menu and click on save menu so after that if you update here
so you can see this is showing here that's great and after that you can change here menu hover color or background color so here you can add a background color that you want Okay, next you can add a border also you can customize this menu next drop down menu so this is very easy to use thank you for watching video